All right, let's talk to Lonnie about this weather and uh, talk about a different day. This is not even January. No skiing out here. No, not What's even going close. On? I mean, we said earlier, almost 70 degrees in portions of our area today, down around the Jersey Shore. What we've got is a warm air mass. It's going to moderate a bit, but trust me, even though you drop by over 10 degrees tomorrow, you're still way above average. There's the picture outside right now. The temperature comes in at this hour. I mean, think about it. You're 60 degrees. It's 549 in the evening, and you're 60 degrees. We max you out at 66, 26 degrees warmer than we typically find this time of the year. So what do you expect? We're going to be warm again tomorrow, but no records out there. Rain chances, not just for tomorrow, but really all the way through the seven-day forecast, just really slight chances out there. Snow chances are even less, and most of January... I'll show you this information in just a bit. Most of January looks to be above average. Now, take a look at what I'm showing you here. This is for January 12th through the 18th. Uh, okay, the real above average warmth is off to our west, but we're going to be a bit above average. Our average temperature during that time span, 39 to 40. I don't have a 39 or 40 as a high temperature any day on the seven-day forecast. And as a matter of fact, Georgia and I just looked at a third and fourth week forecast, so way out, okay, three and four weeks out. Basically, it's a similar picture. We just keep it a little bit above average the entire time. And, and we got to make a shift. We really do. For a healthy atmosphere, we got to make a shift here at some point in time. And I don't see it really for at least for the next two weeks, if not the next three or four weeks. What about snowfall? You know what? We haven't had any measurable snow in New York City, not since Je December 1st. And that gives us a snowfall deficit, not rainfall deficit, of five and a half inches. We got nothing, zero, squat, and I don't see anything brewing in terms of snow at all. Rainfall, again, a couple of little light showers are pushing on through. Heavier batch of rain offshore. Look at that, some thunderstorms actually offshore of Ocean County, and that may clip portions of the east end of Long Island. Bigger picture is going to show you. All right, this ragged front is going to be moving through. A southerly wind will shift around to a westerly wind, but again, you're going to go from 66 to about 53 or so tomorrow. So it's going to be cooler, but you know, it, you're still above average. A big weather story brewing out west. These areas of low pressure just rolling on shore. So yesterday in our newscast, we were showing you pictures around Sacramento and the terrible flooding they've had. Well, they're getting more rain. And that's also big mountain snow out there. So if any of you are skiers, I think for the next couple of weeks, East Coast skiing is just not happening. you got to go out west. So rainfall, here we go. This is what we're seeing right now. You watch this. It's all going to play out. You may get clipped at the east end with a, a little heavier downpour. Not too much rain for anybody out there as you go through the overnight hours. There's some. I'd have an umbrella. Thursday, maybe a raindrop here or there. Then you get to Friday. Remember we said a very slight chance for a, a, a snowflake? Well, maybe a raindrop at 3.30 in the morning. Watching the mountains up around Sullivan County, maybe. Maybe a wet snowflake, but most people are not going to see anything like that because look at the temperatures. I mean, there's one day on that that the morning low, the coldest temperature will be 32 early Sunday morning. Otherwise, you know, you're, you're, you don't see 39s and 40 degree readings. You're 41 as the lowest reading on Sunday. All those numbers are above average. So while we drop it down tomorrow, drop it down more so on Friday, still above average. It's so nuts. I mean, Tough. it's. It it is nuts. And KJ, the people who make their living at these snow areas, at yeah. the skiers, they can't even make snow yeah, it's with bad. situations like that. All right, Lonnie. Thank okay, you. Okay, guys.